Hello drum enthusiasts, welcome back to Rooney Reacts. I've got my coffee, I've got my headphones, and I'm going to check out a little bit of Sammy Davis Jr. playing the drums. Um, perhaps not known as a drummer, but definitely a multi-talented entertainer from back in the day. I have actually seen a clip of Sammy playing the drums before. Uh, it's a quite a well-known one. He jumps around, he um, sort of does a bit of Bit of a joke, bit of patter, then jumps on the drum kit, plays a solo with his band, um, and then he jumps on the vibes, and it's a really, really impressive clip. I actually was going to do that one, but then when I watched it back today, uh, there were a few things that I thought, I'm not 100% sure this is live, that could be sacrilege to say that, but I just couldn't actually quite tell. I think he can certainly play. He And if he was miming, I'm not saying he was, but if he was, it was a really good mime. I just couldn't see any mics. Um, the sound was really high quality, but I just couldn't see any mics. And at one point, I think the drummer was playing with sticks on a chair or a table or something, um, getting sort of a clicky, clicky um, snare sound uh, going along and I, there were just no mics but it was coming through very clearly maybe they had really hot room mics i'm not sure but anyway without further ado let's get into sammy davis jr drum solo live in hamburg germany 1969 
Cool. So no doubt here that he's really plain. He's really plain. And he seems like a really good drummer. It was uh, one interesting part for me. Around the four-minute mark, I heard um, there was a little bit of bass, bass pedal um, noise going on. It sounded like his bass pedal might have come loose from the bass drum I'm picking, maybe. And then he sort of focused on the hand stuff and did his... And actually, speaking of that, when he quite interesting, when he got to the repetitive motifs, that's when the crowd went... Um, and it is those repetitive motifs that, you know, your Joe public, that's what they sort of need to latch on to. Um, really, really cool drumming. He definitely does swing, and obviously he, he was in that kind of world of swing, so he would have been hearing that all the time. And, yeah, it's a really, really curious one, actually, these sort of, I guess, non-drummers or... or that sounds really awful, but um, hobbyists or, or part-time drummers who are really good. Um, I mean, you know, I'm not a soloist. He's a better soloist than I am. Uh, he's got some really nice stuff going on there. The drums sounded amazing. He, he, he got an amazing sound out of them. That's another thing that people often misunderstand. The, it's all well and good having a great sounding drum kit, but you've got to make it sound good. And he was getting some really nice um, dynamics happening on the snare, rim shots, quiet. He brought the dynamics right down. It was the classic sort of take the crowd on a journey type of drum solo, really, with a beginning, middle, and an end. A real, a real crowd pleaser. Um, yeah, it was. It's just so interesting. I, I really need to go back and revisit. There are actually a couple of videos of him playing the drums uh, floating around YouTube. So I definitely want to have a look now and I'm really curious. And there's a couple of other sort of people in his world. I know Mel Torme is another one who was another, you know, uh, personality, but not known as a drummer, but he could play the drums really well also. I believe Mel Torme was good friends with Buddy Rich. So um, yeah, it's interesting. I, I, actually, I remember reading Frank Sinatra's uh, biography and I, I believe Frank said something along the lines of he is uh, Sammy Davis Jr. is the most talented person he knew um, and so I mean it says a lot I mean obviously they're friends and he's going to pump them up a little bit but yeah singing, dancing performing, drumming comedy on the vibes <sighs> just mind blowing, uh, incredible incredibly skillful man I still haven't had any requests for uh, drum videos yet, so it would be great to hear from you guys if you want uh, to see me react to something new. This was a really fun one. had never seen this one before. Um, so, yeah, I look forward to uh, hearing your guys' requests and hopefully get into those really soon. All right, take it easy.